DJI Mavic Pro get checked after 150 flights. Welcome back to Take Apart. In this video, I will take apart my Mavic Pro and check internal components, and I will clean dust, which has been accumulated there over the time. Firstly, remove the battery, and I recommend to keep gimbal lock in. I will open top cover and see places where cooling air is passing and ejects. So let's go. Hex bit and remove two screws holding the plastic covers under the front arms. Covers are clicked there so pop and remove. Another two screws underneath. Moving on, six screws, two outside and four under the battery. They are a bit tight in my opinion, but better tight than loose. Oh yes, the last one has to be cunt, like always. Anyway, flip it and remove the last two screws next to the gimbal. Now just wiggle and de-click top cover around. Get some plastic tool to protect your drone. Once it's loose, get in from rear end. That's what she said. Nah, serious. Unplug the GPS antenna and try to remove a cover. It can be a little tricky on front, but it will eventually do what it needs to do. Now the cover is out and I am impressed. There is not much dust at all. So I will just check connectors, cables, and give it a little clean with this small soft brush. This drone has done 150 flights, but there is not much dust. I was expecting more, at least like in a desktop PC after months. But obviously, up in the air is no dust. Once it's all clean, the cover can go back. Don't forget to plug GPS. And just click cover on the place. Start putting screws back in. I have to mention that if you disconnect GPS and reconnect it, the Mavic Pro will give you GPS error. So don't worry, only thing you need to do is refresh a firmware. It happened to me on the end. 
but simple firmware refresh will fix it. Surely it is extra 20 minutes, but better than goofing around on the internet and looking for solution. Check description of this video and subscribe in the meantime. I have a lot more videos about Mavic Pro and much more. So let's check, remove a gimbal lock, put a battery in, turn it on, everything looks ok until this point, red light and system warning. Simply just refresh the firmware and everything will be ok. Thanks for watching and see you next time. If you looking for internet security, go to description of this video and sign up for NordVPN. The best VPN out there, get up to 80% off.